Hey, this is Dancing Rabbit, and welcome to another Weekend Pagan Perspective. This week's sort of general open-ended question has to do with fertility and creativity. When I read the question, I really wasn't sure how I was going to go about answering it, so I watched a couple of the other hosts, and I'm going to try not to repeat, but I will sort of bounce off of their various takes on this. As a uh, 61-year-old man in a monogamous married relationship with a 61-year-old female, we are really not concerned with um, the having babies or producing babies aspect of fertility. I think that at a much younger age, you know, had I been in a relationship, then I probably would have. And for someone the age of the questioner this week, that's the emphasis, and it's literal fertility. I think in the older days, um, 500,000, 10,000 years ago, um, physical fertility was much more important. Uh, populations were much smaller. There were all sorts of natural disasters and diseases that could sweep through and wipe out uh, you know, two-thirds of the population of a region. So fertility and also the idea that the uh, children or grandchildren were going to take care of the parents as they got older, and older was probably 40s or 50s at that time. Anyway, that, that sort of fertility was much more important than it is today, and I think even today it's important if you're at that you know, that, that right age and it's the right time in your life. As far as uh, fertility, a little more symbolically in nature, uh, you know, once again, if you're in an agricultural or a hunter-gather society, uh, sorry, that's the uh, Bazinjis having a conversation, um, if you're raising your own food, and that's basically your only source of food, that sort of fertility would be a whole lot more important and even though you know here in the big city we don't raise a lot of our own food we wouldn't starve to death or even miss a meal if we had a crop failure fertility for me is much more of the fertility of my garden uh, the fertility of the plants of the earth more in general than you know personal having babies fertility. Creativity, uh, yeah, as a teacher and an author, um, a very amateur musician, there's some creativity involved. I don't know that I particularly do rituals to get, to improve, to produce fertility, but uh, creativity, sorry, creativity, but I don't see any reason why a person couldn't if that was something they wanted to do. Um, creativity, coming up with new ideas and being able to do creative things is really important to me. So much of life can be mundane and boring um, about doing what you have to do to get through it, to get by, to do, to live that it's important to find creative outlets, whether it's writing or music or whatever it is. And I think for each of us it will probably be a different thing. So, you know, the question, I'm, I'm really a, a detailed person, a specific rather than a generalist, and so for me this question was hard. It was hard to know whether I've answered it, whether I've come up with an answer that was what you were looking for or whether it was an answer that was helpful. But I hope at least it hasn't been too boring, at least it hasn't been too long. So till next time, Dancing Rabbit wishing you and yours lots and lots of peace.